I'm uh, David Gledhill. I'm an artist based in Manchester, and all the paintings are based on secondhand snapshots, which I find in flea markets uh, around Europe. And I'm really interested in um, history. I'm absolutely fascinated by history, um, but not the kind of history that's about governments or kings and queens, more about the experience of history uh, that ordinary people like myself have. But what I'm looking for usually is something that's got a little clue as to where and when it was taken and who the person in the photograph is. There are two paintings that are mounted in suitcases in the exhibition and these two paintings are of a chap called Karl Hoffmann. Karl was an ethnic German and he was living in the western side of Czechoslovakia at the end of the war in 1945. He fled across the border from where he was living into what became East Germany. So I wanted to put them in suitcases to suggest that flight, you know, that escape. And the suitcases I've used are 1940s Czechoslovakian suitcases. He probably threw his most treasured possessions into suitcases and maybe went on foot just a few miles across that border. I managed to get hold of five studio portraits of the same person. These portraits show a young man in his prime who wants to be a part of something. If you just look in his left eye, you can see his pupils are slightly dilated and he's staring fixedly off to one side. A hint of fanaticism. I was just fascinated by them because he's obviously very proud to have become a member of the Nazi party. There's evidence of these people's lives in these boxes in flea markets that, that really kind of strikes me. It really kind of motivates me to try and bring them back to life, to bear witness to the history they lived through. So you just get little hints of how people lived and what they actually felt and, and thought at the time that the shutter went. Uh, those are the, the photographs that I enjoy working with most. And by using these snapshots, I get glimpses and hints and stories about how people survived, whether they hid, whether they collaborated, whether they wholeheartedly embraced the politics, the events of their day. So for me, that's what these paintings are all about.